I can't help but wonder. Would I have been able to save you? I wanted time to stand still. More than anything. I felt completely powerless. I wished time would stop. If the moment could have lasted forever, we... I wished for the unthinkable. Just like M. I proved to be just like him. For my part, this is all I need. When did you two? It was when we first fought against them. Ever since then, Em and I were swapped around. I see. I honestly thought you were Em back there. You had me fooled. Maybe that's a bad way to put it. In any case, I didn't realize at all. I did try my best. I couldn't afford to fail. If anyone suspected me, you'd have all been executed on the spot. But her feelings... I couldn't simply let them go to waste. Em's... feelings? She wanted to give you everything that she knew about Em. To help us escape. To break this never-ending Mobius curse. To lose and lose and still stand back up. Even in the depths of despair. She wanted you to have the strength to defeat those at the root of that despair. She sure had a lot of faith in me. Oh. She believed that if anyone in the world could make it possible, it would be you. That's why she merged our will so we could act to further our goal. Earlier, you said it was fun, but it wasn't you, it was Em. I really think she meant it. It was brief, but being who I am now, passing my thoughts along onto you, and receiving yours in turn, she was grateful. I see. From that moment, Em's words were my words, and my words were now hers. Her life was scattered on the breeze, but her memories and her will live on inside my heart. Come, I have something to show you.
Should be time for dinner soon, right? You can never go wrong with Samita. Here. M was still unsure to the very last whether to show you the memory of this place. But I think it would be best. This place, it was everything to N. What do you mean? Well, you see, this is where the city once stood. It did? It was long ago. The city back then, it was much more prosperous than now. It positively teemed with people. So then, it must have drawn Mobius' ire even more than now. before you, your heart's desire. There is no life within. You must breathe it into her yourself. <gasps> life from the people of the city. You want me to end every one of them? Why the hesitation? Existing in this place, is by itself a result of your own choices. You are the one who chose the endless now, are you not? Your response should already be predetermined. Such a shame. City's inhabitants were the descendants of M, N, and others who became Ouroboros in the past. In exchange for the lease on life they would get as Mobius, Zed ordered N to kill the city's people. to exist as Mobius, the same as myself. So you did it. 
sealed our fate. Now we can live forever. But this feud has been stamped out before its time. And... I can't even disappear. Only two things were important to him. Impossible. How could one ever choose between them? Surely he couldn't... do it. And yet... he did make a choice. No one can truly judge him for the things he did. Repentance. Mm. The intentions they left behind, they turned into us. Mm. Of course, it's heartbreaking, but... But still, she was smiling. We have to change things. Yeah. And this time, we'll succeed. So it's set. Our new goal. Agreed? Yes. He can't get away with this. And I'm not feeling very forgiving either. But guys... Now we know there's an even bigger bad behind that snuffer. Zed. Making someone choose the impossible? It's so cruel. Thanks, everyone. Looks like your minds are made up. Here, this is yours. By the by, who is that Zed sleazebag? He's something like the head of all Mobius, or so it seemed. I've only met him in... The memories that M showed me, though. We now know his power is vast. Far greater than any of the others in Mobius. Damn, so he's... Yes. He is our true adversary. The one who formed... the world we know. Just who decided that this was how it should be? If I knew who they were or where I'd...
Let's return to the castle. Yep, we can help with the cleanup. Feels like we have one less worry now, eh? Agreed. They should be able to start on repairs now. Not what I meant, though. I meant this whole thing. Mio, that's right. At that moment, everything just felt so utterly hopeless that it hurt. There wasn't a thing I could do. But it still worked out, right? Huh. Thanks to all of you being there. Ah. What? Surprised you didn't choke on those words. Well, of course not. I can express some emotions. <laughs> Has to be a reason we met. Hmm? Say what? It's something that Noah said once. And you found a reason. We've seen one wish granted. True. Still, we've got a way to go. This isn't nearly the end. No rest for Boros. At least we've won ourselves an extension. Oh, uh, it'll work out somehow. Uni, am I sensing a streak of optimism? I thought you were one to worry about the details a bit more. Now I've got a reliable guy... ...to stand by me, so... Oh. What, and, and who m might that be, then? <laughs> That'll be my secret.
already getting dark. Let's make the most of our break, guys. Come on, let's keep going. Better make sure we're well rested. I think we need to discuss this. Let's get going. Time's a waste. Now I remember, Tiny got that message from Izzard, right? I did. I was thinking now might be a good time to see him. I'm sure you'll have a lot to talk about. We'll be waiting outside. Thank you. I'll try to make it quick. What's this? This was an Imoase. A lens. A membrane covering an iris. Nimue, use this. Yeah. It must have been five years ago. It was on an expedition to the Cadencia frontier. However, Kvezi troops attacked at night. My squad was crushed. And I was hurt bad.
The one who nursed me back to health was Nimue. Theirs was a curious colony. No one ever fought. They'd spend their days tending Zephronias. There used to be a castle there at one time. But at some point it was destroyed in a great battle. And there it lay in ruins. It was there that I saw some cradles left over from that time. They looked like they would break at any minute. But still, some were making soldiers. Nimue, she was just one of them. The people there, they were like we are now. They lived free of the flame clock's yoke. Sir, you say they were like us. So perhaps their colony was freed by Ouroboros at some point in the past. Well, I'm not sure. It looked like Nimue and the others had always been living off the land. Also, they'd been strictly shunning contact with others for generations. Naturally, most people there gave me the cold shoulder. Before long, I journeyed away from the colony, along with Nimue. Nimue left with you? Why, sir? There's a world out there. It'd be nice to see it. I wondered at her motivations, but I think I see now. Now we don't live under the flame clock's yoke. We're more free to consider our emotions. Back then, Nimue had to carefully hide the fact that her iris was unconnected to a flame clock. She enlisted a Nopon engineer to make the lens. All so she could live among us. And after that, she became the Nimue you know. I never knew you two had such a connection. Incredible. But why show me this now? Well, actually... What? The leadership want Nimue's colony wiped out? Yeah. We only just heard. A Nopon merchant was able to tip us off. And since Nopon are involved in handling most logistics and transportation, the information should be good. So the brass have pinpointed its location? Could be. You don't have to be so cagey, Commander. Cagey? You can tell it to me straight. Am I wrong? You'd like us to keep Nimue's colony safe. But... Isn't that the reason? Why you've told me this whole story? If you moved to protect the colony, it'd put this place in the line of fire. I've heard. Like how, after the Consul's disappearance and the loss of the Flame Clock, despite sending a report to HQ, you haven't received a word of reply. Hmm. We reported that it all happened while we lay there unconscious, which is the unvarnished truth. Yet still nothing. I understand. Let me run it past the others, Commander. This is some story. Huh. There's something I want to discuss with everyone. Could I have a moment of your time? Let's make the most of our break, guys. Okay, now we go... where exactly? We could do with some food. Could you all come round for a second? The 
those two must have shared a lot of memories. Like you said, Tyler. Sounds like Ouroboros got involved in the past. So that pretty much makes it our business. Count us in, mate. Saffronia. That's that thingy, right? We saw one growing once. If there's loads of them blooming somewhere, that's something I'd want to see. Huh? I'm shocked. What? I got black flowers and junk. Banana too! Banana had wished to see flowers! This is unusually proactive for you, Banana. Why so? Ladies with flowers are like peas of same pot! No idea what Manana talk about. But someone had to keep Manana out of trouble. That okay? With friend Tyon? Sure. Thank you, everyone. Thanks. I'm sorry to involve you in this. Don't worry. We all agree that this is something we should do. It's a while since we first got thrown together. We're used to this by now. And, you know, we want to see Sophronia's. It was me. I'm the one who threw Nimue's life into chaos. I should have just left her where she was. Commander. Kion. Sir? If Nimue's been reborn, if she's in that colony, keep her safe by any means. This time, I want her to follow the path she was meant to tread. Yes, sir. I promise. I don't get it. Why doesn't the commander just come along? He's got no choice, right? He might get the attention of the castle or something. Oh, guess so. That's not all, I think. What? Huh? I'm sure he must be scared. If he meets her again, he might end up behaving the same way towards her. Is that a bad thing? No, I don't think so. But I do understand how he feels. Yeah, I, I definitely hesitate. It's not just about himself. If I hadn't been so careless, the commander wouldn't have to feel this way. You're not still thinking like that, are you? No, no. I, I'm... I'm just... You're just what? Looking back all the time never helped nobody. Look, I... I know. Right? Come on, then. Uni. Huh? Okay, sorry. I know you're right. Feeling the pressure yet? No, why would I be? I'm fine. There's a Pharonis here. Looks like it's trying to clear away the earth. No sneaking through with this big thing in the way. I think we found the enemy force the commander mentioned. <sighs> Manana not see any people! Whole unit made up of Lebnesis. Much weirdness. Hang on, look. A console. They haven't found us, have they? No. I don't think they've spotted us just yet. 
This one might have different abilities than that K guy. Guess that's a thing. But why have only Levnesses? I can't fathom what this Mobius can do. But they're about to wipe out an allied colony. They'd have a fun time explaining that to soldiers. True, true. Let's hurry. All that digging will take some time. If we can bypass this unit, we should be able to beat them there. Let's do that. And make sure we don't get spotted. Ready? Stay undetected this way. Oh, that's a rare one. 